In this presentation, we will learn how to access members of a structure using structure pointer. So let's get started. Here is a program in which I have declared a struct ABC, which consists of two members X and Y, both are of integer type, right? And within this main function, I have a variable A of type struct ABC. And because I have a variable of type struct ABC, I would be able to access these members using this variable. Basically, I'm assigning values to these members using this variable a. Here, x will get value 0 and y will get value 1. That is what we have learned in the previous lecture, right? After that, we have a pointer to a variable of type struct abc. So this is the pointer to some variable of type struct abc. And in this case, it contains the address of variable a. And we can verify that variable a is having type struct abc. And this is also a pointer which is pointing to some variable of type struct abc, right? So it must contains the address of a variable of type struct abc, and that is what it contains. After that, we have the statement ptr arrow with x, right? This pointer is pointing to the variable x. Now, what does this mean? ptr arrow x is equivalent to star ptr dot x. That means we will first dereference the pointer and then we will access the member. So let me replace this by star ptr dot x. I can replace this ptr by ampersand a, right? because ptr contains the address of a. Now star and ampersand gets cancelled out, which means that we are left with a only. So finally we are left with a dot x, which means that we are accessing the member of this variable a. That is, we are accessing this member x of this variable a. x contains value 0, therefore this will get replaced by 0. Isn't that so? Similarly, ptr y can be replaced by star ptr dot y, which means finally, it will get replaced by a dot y and a dot y can be replaced by 1, right? So what is the output of this program? 0 and 1. So in this way, we can access the members of variable a using a pointer. That is what I have tried to explain in this particular presentation, okay? Okay friends, this is it for now. Thank you for watching this presentation.